In this video, I give my dog Nana an AI personality and try to play three levels of Helldivers 2. And every five minutes, I must stop what I'm doing and give Nana a status report. So let's get to it. General Nana, we're about to start our first siege and quest line. Do you have any words of encouragement for myself or chat? Listen up, Goodbeard. In the heat of battle, remember your training and remember your purpose. We're not just fighting for ourselves. We're fighting for every freedom-loving soul out there. Let's show these tin cans and creepy crawlies what it means to stand for something greater than ourselves. Dismissed. Thank you, General Nana. Mission one, launch the rocket. The first quest is to launch an ICBM. Basically do these mini objectives to launch the rocket and then go home. Okay, here we go. So right there, there's people over there. Oh God. Let me just jump up, man. So right now they're all looking for me over there by that rock. All right, so where is the launch codes at? I'm literally surrounded by enemies right now. Oh yeah, right there, you're right. Cool. Objective done. So let's go south, clear that out. Meters. General Nana, an update from the front. We have obtrieved the launch codes to take out the enemy scum, and now we head south. What are your orders, Nana? Well, 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 Goodbeard. It seems you've finally done something right for a change. But don't get too cocky. You're still a long way from earning my trust. <laughs> now listen up, maggot. With those launch codes in hand, we hold the fate of this war in our grasp. Head south like your life depends on it, because it does. Don't you dare falter now, or... I'll personally make sure you regret it for the rest of your sorry existence. Move out. Thank you, General Nana. Getting the launch codes was no problem, and now we head south to power the rocket base. General Nana, an update from the front. We needed to get the launch codes, and we're powering the rocket launcher as we speak. What is your advice? It's about time you showed some initiative. But don't think for one second that this excuses all your past blunders. <laughs> Now, keep that rocket launcher powered up and ready to go. Okay. We're not here to play patty cake I don't have with the a rocket enemy. launcher. We're here to rain down justice on their metallic heads. Okay. So, stand tall and make sure that rocket hits its mark. Failure is not an option, unless you want to find yourself on the receiving end of a one-way ticket to the brig. <laughs> now, get to it, traitor. Just the casual traitor. Thank you, General Nana. Now that we charge the station, it's time to launch the big rocket. Looks like he's doing the computer. I shall help with the levers. It's simple. Someone runs to the computer while the rest of us unlock the hatch. But it's been five minutes and we got to update Nana. General Nana, an update from the front. We're here at the rocket launcher and we're sending off the rocket now. We're about to deliver sweet liberty. About time. But remember, this ain't no joyride. It's a mission to uphold the very fabric of democracy. So... When you launch that rocket, make sure it sings the sweet song of freedom as it <laughs> obliterates those robotic tyrants. And don't you dare mess it up, or I'll have you scrubbing latrines until your beard turns gray. Oh, thank now, you. launch that rocket and make me proud, maggot. <laughs> Why does it gotta say maggot that way, dude? Thank you, Nana. You're the real hero we deserve. With the rocket prepping to launch, we have to defend the area until it launches to deliver democracy. And that's the mission. Now let's extract and start the next one with General Nana. But first, a message. Don't you dare start celebrating yet, Goodbeard. Victory is only sweet if it's complete. And I won't rest until every last robo scum lies in ruins at our feet. <laughs> but I'll give credit where it's due. You managed not to completely bungle this one. Now, let's capitalize on this momentum and keep pushing forward until every inch of this battlefield belongs to democracy. And remember, one success doesn't make up for a mountain of failures, so don't get any ideas about slacking off. Dismiss, traitor. <laughs> Dismiss, traitor. Mission two, rescue VIPs. The next mission is an emergency evacuation. But first, you gotta do something over here. General Nana, we're off to rescue high-value targets. What do you have to say? Well, well, looks like it's time to play hero, Goodbeard. <laughs> but let me remind you, Democracy ain't about hand-holding and babysitting. It's about tough choices and sacrifices. So if those high-value targets are worth their salt, they better be ready to fight tooth and nail for their freedom. They will not do that. And as for you, don't you dare let sentimentality cloud your judgment. If those targets slow us down or compromise the mission, I'll have your hide. Now, move out. Thank you, General Nana, for your wise words. Throw something on top of it and watch it go. 
democracy, baby. General Nana, it's a slow push towards rescuing the VIPs. Sounds like you're dragging your feet, good bear. <laughs> I'm Remember, not. Every second wasted is another second those VIPs spend in the clutches of our enemies. Pick up the pace and show some backbone. We didn't come here to tiptoe through the tulips. We came to <laughs> kick down doors and take names. Thank you, General Nana, for those wise words. Hey, while we're in the middle of this, let's update Nana. General Nana, we're still pushing towards the VIPs. Do you have any advice? Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure everything's fine. As I lay here. Here's some advice for you, Goodbeard. Pick up the pace and stop <laughs> dilly dallying. Those VIPs ain't gonna rescue themselves. My destination. You know. Now move out, traitor. Thank you, Nana. At the data relay, we calibrate the satellite, and now we're ready to push our way to the VIPs. But it's been five minutes, so I have to update Nana. Update from the front. We've cleared out all the enemy bases, and we're heading our way to the VIPs. Finally, some good news. <laughs> Looks like you're not completely useless after all, good beard. <laughs> but don't start patting yourself on the back just yet. Until those VIPs are safe and sound, our job ain't done. Keep your wits about you and stay focused on the mission. Thank you, General Nana. And if you even think about slacking off now, I'll have you running obstacle courses until you beg for mercy. Oh my gosh. Now get a move on and bring those VIPs home, Soul Jolter. What did she say at the end? She said soldier all weird. Now off to the VIPs. The goal is simple. Push this button and then the VIPs run to escape. Pretty simple. Good news, Nana. We finally rescued the VIPs. Looks like you managed to stumble your way into success for once, good beard. Don't get too comfortable though. Rescuing VIPs is just the beginning. Now make sure those high and mighty folks remember who saved their hide. <laughs> and as for you, don't think this makes up for all your past failures. <laughs> You're still the worst, and one oh, success thank you. doesn't change that. Thank you. <laughs> now get those VIPs to safety and don't mess it up, traitor. Why does she gotta be so mean? And then we extract to the next mission. I only died a few times and we saved the VIPs. A few times, huh? Well, even a broken clock is right twice a day, good beard. But don't <laughs> expect me to throw you a parade just because you managed not to completely botch this one. Saving VIPs and clearing objectives is what you signed up for. So don't expect a pat on the back for doing your job. We're not out of the woods yet, traitor. So don't you dare let your guard down. <laughs> traitor. Thank you, Nana. But before leaving, we do celebratory hugs. And now it's time for the final mission to defend this space. Luckily, we've got a full team. But first, a pep talk from Nana. Don't tell me you're turning soft on me now, good beard. This ain't some <laughs> summer camp love fest. It's war. Save the hugs for the victory celebrations, assuming you ever earn one. That's what we did! And as for you, don't you forget your place. We're not here to make friends, we're here to win battles. Now wipe those tears and get ready for the next mission. There's no rest for the wicked traitor. Yes, Nana. Thank you. Wait, why is she against hugs? Nana, quick question. Chat wants to know if you approve of hugs. <laughs> we're just in the middle of things, talking to General Nana. Chat, I appreciate the sentiment behind hugs. But in the heat of battle, it's best to save the affection for after the mission's done. <laughs> We're soldiers, not teddy bears. There's a time and a place for everything. And during a mission, ain't it. The defense battle was easy, mainly because all these mortars, just so many mortars. But five minutes passed, so I have to update Nana. Hey Nana, this may be a rough time to ask this, but can you send reinforcements? Sounds like you've bitten off more than you can <laughs> chew, good beard. But don't come crying to me just because you can't handle the heat. We're in the thick of it now, and there's no turning back. But fine, I'll send you what I can spare. Just don't expect miracles. <laughs> and don't you dare let those reinforcements down. Thank you, They're Nana. They're their trust in you, traitor. So don't you dare disappoint them. My god. Did we get any of your reinforcements or friendly? <laughs> She's not going to specify. Yes! The chaos! There's so many mortars, man. One, two, three, four... Five turrets in this vicinity. Six turrets. Defending the base was easy. Now let's extract. Guys, bring it in. Before we go, bring it in. Hug me. Somebody hug me. Heck yeah! <laughs> and just like that, General Nana led us to victory. General Nana, we defended the base and launched as much Liberty rockets as we could. And we're heading home. Any word for chat and myself? Looks like you managed to scrape by this time, good beard. Defending the base and launching those rockets is a start, but don't think for one second that you're off the hook. Remember, victory ain't just about surviving. It's about crushing the enemy underfoot. <laughs> As for you, 
chat, don't get too comfortable patting yourselves on the back. <laughs> There's still plenty of work to be done, and I won't rest until every last robo scum and bug is nothing but a pile of scrap. So, celebrate this small victory if you must, but don't you dare forget that the war ain't over until I say it is. Dismissed. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Bye bye.